Last episode, I've been challenged to do some strange, strange things. And today we're going to do them. Looks like EC has been doing his challenge because his challenge is to carry a pet chicken around wherever he goes. And this chicken wasn't here before. Seems kind of sus, if you ask me. So I made this little shelf here in my starter base with all of the challenges. And these are the active challenges I have right now, which is wear your skin wrong and prank someone and blame it on someone else. So I guess we have to change our skin now, don't we? Okay, this is odd. This is really strange. <laughs> I'm wearing my skin backwards. This is so awkward. Aha, now it works. <laughs> I think we're going to have to confuse some people with this skin. I'm holding the totem backwards. This is so strange. This is so strange. You know what's one of the most useful items in Minecraft? I can't take my skin seriously. <laughs> it is the elytra, of course. Flying is wonderful. Oh my god, this looks so strange. <laughs> oh my god, this looks so dumb. <laughs> Okay, this skin is the weirdest. Ah, EC and his weird challenges. But yes, elytras are very useful and so are rockets. And why don't we capitalize on that? This is my hair. I want to make a rocket shop. Yes, I'm talking over my elytra. This skin is so weird. So in today's episode, <laughs> this looks so dumb. We're going to do that. And before we do some rocket shop shenanigans... We're going to prank someone and blame it on someone else. I have to run some errands at the shopping district and I hope they sell the items I need name tags. There we go. Oh, they have them. Wonderful. And while we are here, there's this nice new tower that appeared in the shopping district and I think it sells something that I desperately want. Mmm, mending. Oh, these are all going to be mine. All right, all my almond tools are now fully enchanted, mending silk touch, everything. It's perfect. And we're here at Brooke's base. You know why we're at her base? Because EC and Brooke have some sort of a prank war going on. So we prank Brooke and blame it on EC. Yes. I think this is kind of like her main storage over here. So we should put the prank right here. And there's a creepy EC facing the wall. Very creepy. Okay, I brought my name tags, my ender pearls. Let's do this. I thought you might like some friends. From EC, of course. <laughs> oh, Metric could ask where I am. Look at me. I've been challenged to wear my skin the other way around. And I've also been challenged to prank someone and blame it on someone else, which is the result over there. I thought you might like some friends. Don't go in there. It's oh. instant death. This isn't instant death. This is cool. Just a little tickle. <laughs> it's a little too. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's hurting a little bit. Do you think Brooke will like her new friends? <laughs> Probably not. Friend of my prank was a success. And Brooke already died in here once. Oopsie. But I got all of her stuff, so it's fine. <laughs> but now it is time to make some farms so we can actually sell rockets and other good stuff. So let's get right into a time lapse. So I've just been AFK at this farm that came in that EC made and I'm allowed to use it of course. Look at all this nice loot. All of the gunpowder will be used for, you know, the rockets. Yeah, the sugarcane farm is slowly but surely getting there too. I might have to expand it. 
or figure out how to make it work better because there seems to be some losses. I think I messed things up. But now it is time to get our hands on Elytras. And you know there's a data pack on the server that lets the dragon drop an Elytra. So we're going to fight the dragon when I shift click it does this. This skin is so weird. So let's kill the dragon about four times. And let's do the first one with a couple other people, shall we? We're all so cute little dragons. <laughs> Look at us. <laughs> All right, the dragon That's fight going. is happening. So let's go to the end. Should we join a group first? Ready, ready, ready. All right, let's fly ready. to the end. Ready. Okay, wait, wait, where's the nether? There's the nether. I love how I'm rocking my iron armor too. This is just great. <laughs> is this the first time you've done it in this world? <laughs> yes, yeah, this is my first time ever. <laughs> wait, so are you the only... Wait, first time ever? Yeah, first time ever. Ooh. Oh, no! That. That's I gonna feel be honored great. to be part of it. Yes, <laughs> it's gonna be so funny. We'll be there when yeah. you die to the dragon armor. for the first time. Yeah. I mean, when you kill the dragon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Did everybody bring a bow? <laughs> no. Oh, yeah. oh, no. <laughs> I don't have one. <laughs> oh no. Wait. Um, I... Kay, would you go ahead to the uh, end? I'll go get a bow. <laughs> right, should we go? We That's should go in. Let's go. This is the end. Well, not yet. <laughs> I think I'm gonna set my spawn here just in case. Oh yeah, just in case. Oh, yeah, good idea. Not that I'm planning oh, to die. No. I haven't died ever <laughs> on the server. Shall we jump in? Ready? Who's going first? Me. I... All right. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye. Come on. Uh, uh, okay, uh, on. Ah! I see the inside of Cayman's head. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that was a creepy sight. There was nothing in there. <laughs> what? How dare you? Does anyone know how to respawn the Ender Dragon? I know End Crystals are involved and I brought four. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to do it either. Okay, I'm gonna Google it. One, don't touch the crystal. Oh. Two, three. If that doesn't work, I swear I'm not killing ghasts again. It works! Okay, it's oh, working. yay! And here comes the dragon! Oh. Everybody run and shoot the crystals. Oh, there's yeah, this. Whoa! Oh. Oh. oh no! I didn't know that was gonna blow me up. I died! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no. Look at the end of it. Oh! Yes! The dragon died! Woohoo! I flew through the exploding dragon. XP! Well done, guys. Oh, cool. Hey, that was awesome. Yes, we killed fun. the dragon. <laughs> we did. Yay! <laughs> Wings. Thank you. Sweet. Perfect. Baby's first fly. <laughs> Baby's first fly. <laughs> Takes a bit of getting. Oh! oh woo! I did it. Yo! Oh, Don't die. <laughs> yo! What a true bonding moment. This was uh -oh. fun. <laughs> 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 like the timing. <laughs> that was the best thing ever. What a true bonding moment. That was so moment. good. That was funny. <laughs> that was honestly just too good. And it is that time of the episode where we give one random diamond to one random person on this server. And you already know how it goes. If you get this video to 30 likes, I will be giving another diamond to another random person. I think I'm gonna give the diamond to block down and oh my days, his base is insane. So good, wow. I'm getting so much inspiration just from looking at it. Look at the mine cards. Oh, this is perfect. And hard work needs to be rewarded with a random diamond. Look at that. Elytras and four of them. And you want to see something even better? The dragon egg and the dragon head. Very nicely displayed in my base. At least this place now has a purpose, my challenge board. I already put this challenge in here, prank someone and blame it on someone else. This one is still kind of going, you know, I've been wearing my skin wrong. I've been wearing the ender dragon onesie, I've been wearing my skin the other way around. All very wrong, you know. So Metrokid is online right now and I've heard he used to sell elytras or maybe he still is. So I kind of want to have his opinion on me selling elytras too, you know. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Friendly competition and all.
Oh, hello. Oh, hello. That was that was a smooth entrance. Yeah, of course. I'm a pro flyer. And speaking of flying, um, there's some business we need to discuss. Ooh, okay, business. I like I like business. Yeah, business is great. You know, so I've been thinking. I haven't uh, set up a shop on the server yet, and I really want to sell rockets and elytras. But uh, uh, I mean, you I... know, ste that's stepping on my toes a little bit, though. I I already sell elytras, even though my shop isn't stocked up. But I already sell elytras. Yeah, that's why I came to you because I was a bit okay. I can't just sell elytras without asking first. I was like. You haven't stocked the shop, and lots of people want Elytra, so... That's true, that's true. I haven't stocked them. I do need to go and grab some more. That's a bit of an issue, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, a little bit, but, I mean, would you be okay with me selling Elytras? I mean, it would, it would help, like, you wouldn't be in a rush to get Elytras, and people could still buy them, but when you stock them, Wait. they would buy from you again? I've got a better idea. Because this is such a pain to get, I feel like... I feel like we should team up. I feel like we should team up. We should run. Like, have you got a shop in mind for this? Like, you you yeah. got a design and everything ready? Okay. So here's here's my proposal. How about we work on this together? We will both sell fireworks and elytras together. You could build the shop. I will provide you with resources if need be, and we can go from there. Actually, that is a really good idea. I think that's that's going to save us both a lot of time and give us diamonds. I feel like it'll save us both a lot of time and potentially a lot of arguing <laughs> and a lot Probably. of undercutting each other. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is true. I don't want to die. <laughs> yeah, I already have a design. Oh, okay. Right. How about you come back to me in an hour or something, if you're still around, and I will sort you everything you need possible Obviously, I'll give you whatever resources I have, and I won't charge you for them, because we're going to work on this together. That's going to be my input on the build, if you already have a design. Oh, and yes. we can go from there. Yeah, that's perfect. Uh, saves me the grind. Awesome. <laughs> awesome stuff, right. I will look forward to seeing it. All right. All right, Metrokid came by and gave me all of this nice stuff, so now I'm going to set up the new shop Right here in this area, I'm going to terraform it and make it look very nice. And then let's get into a time lapse and build that shop. I'm still wearing the Ender Dragon onesie.
I hope you enjoyed that time lapse. Um, may I walk you around my new shop, or should I say, mine and Metricate's new shop? Because he's my business partner. I have this Ender Dragon carpet. I think this is such a fun idea. Come in here as all Elytra and Ender Dragon themed. You know, the rockets are here. We have a rare dragon egg, 32 diamonds. I mean, that's, that's fair. I don't know how they're going to get it down here, though, because, you know, when you right click on it, it does that. Well, now I have to find it. I didn't think this through. So we have a Rocketeer, three stacks for two diamonds. I think this is slightly undercutting Jamesy Boy's rocket shop because he does have a rocket shop as well. So we're going to be in competition, but he's also selling other nice stuff that we aren't selling. So we won't just be undercutting him completely. And now it is time to put the wings in place. The premium wings, fully enchanted with Metric Kids Unbreaking and Mending books. I got the wings, I killed the dragon, he gets the books. And now we have all the elytras in. We decided on 30 diamonds each for an elytra, so we would each get 15 diamonds, because we share. And you get one stack of rockets with every elytra purchase. Isn't that nice? And I might sell something else here in the future, maybe some enchanted armor or unenchanted armor. We're going to see. And up there is the staff room, which is an empty room. Don't look there. Don't ever look there. Look at those nice shiny elytras over there. Oh, I hope we're going to be rich after this shop has been found by all the other people on the server. And I hope you liked the design of the shop. It was a lot of fun to put it together, especially working with this strange block palette. I've never used jungle logs and dripstone terracotta. Very strange, but it looks really nice. So with that being said, I'm still wearing the Ender Dragon suit. I know. I hope you have enjoyed this episode. See you in the next one. Bye.